Question. Which cannot be used with my Oracle support, Moss. A. Reset the password or unlock the account for the tenancy administrator. B. Request a service limit increase. C. Add or change a tenancy administrator. D. Troubleshoot your resources in an Oracle Cloud Infrastructure free trial account. Correct answer. D. Troubleshoot your resources in an Oracle Cloud Infrastructure free trial account. Question. Which two are enabled by Oracle Cloud Infrastructure fault domains? Choose two. A. To mitigate the risk of large-scale events such as earthquakes. B. Protect against unexpected hardware or power supply failures. C. To meet requirements for legal jurisdictions. D. Protect against planned hardware maintenance. E. Build replicated systems for disaster recovery. Correct answer. B. Protect against unexpected hardware or power supply failures. D. Protect against planned hardware maintenance. Question. Which is a key benefit of using Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Autonomous Data Warehouse? A. Maintain root-level access to the underlying operating system. B. Scale both CPU and storage without downtime. C. Apply database patches as they become available. D. No username and password required. Correct answer. B. Scale both CPU and storage without downtime. Question. Which Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, OSI, service can send you an alert when you might exceed your spending threshold? A. Budgets. B. Monitoring. C. Streaming. D. Events. Correct answer. A. Budgets. Question. A customer is looking to migrate their old database backups from their on-premises data center to Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, OSI. Which OCI service is the most cost-effective? A. Archive Storage. B. Block Volume. C. Object Storage. Standard. Correct answer. C. Object Storage. Standard. Question. Which three components are part of Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Identity and Access Management Service? Choose three. A. Users. B. Dynamic Groups. C. Regional Subnets. D. Roles. E. Compute Instances. F. Virtual Cloud Networks. G. Policies. Correct answer. A. Users. B. Dynamic Groups. G. Policies. Question. Which is not covered by Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Service Level Agreement? SLA? A. Availability. B. Reliability. C. Manageability. D. Performance. Correct answer. B. Reliability. Question. You are analyzing your Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, OSI, usage with cost analysis tool in OCI console, which is not a default feature of the tool. A. Filter costs by tags. B. Filter costs by date. C. Filter costs by applications. D. Filter costs by compartments. Correct answer. C. Filter costs by applications. Question. Which gateway can be used to provide internet access to an Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Compute instance in a private submit? A. Internet Gateway. B. NAT Gateway. C. Service Gateway. D. Dynamic Routing Gateway. Correct answer. B. NAT Gateway. Question. What do the terms OPX and CAPX refer to? A. OPX refers to operational expansion and CAPX refers to capital expenses. B. OPX refers to operational example and CAPX refers to capital example. C. OPX refers to operational excellence and CAPX refers to capital excellence. D. OPS refers to operational expenditure and CAPX refers to capital expenditure. Correct answer. D. OPS refers to operational expenditure and CAPX refers to capital expenditure. Question. After signing up for a new Oracle Cloud infrastructure tenancy, what would you subscribe to in order to deploy infrastructure and services in different parts of the world? A. Fault domains. B. Regions. C. Pay-as-you-go pricing. D. Availability domains. Correct answer. B. Regions. Question. Which is an example of edge services in Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, OSI? A. Virtual Firewall B. Object Storage. C. Virtual Cloud Network, VCN. D. Web Application Firewall Correct Answer D. Web Application Firewall Question You were recently assigned to manage a project to deploy Oracle eBusiness Suite on Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, OSI. The application will require a database, several servers, and a shared file system. Which three OCI services are best suited for this project? Choose three. A. OCI Streaming Service B. Object Storage Service 
C file storage service. D virtual machine, VM or bare metal BM, compute instances, E OCI virtual or bare metal DB systems. F Oracle container engine for Kubernetes. Correct answer. B object storage service. C file storage service. E OCI virtual or bare metal DB systems. Question. What characteristics are defined by an Oracle cloud infrastructure compute shape? A availability domain and fault domain locations. B number of vCPU, amount of RAM, bandwidth, C number of OCPU, amount of RAM, bandwidth, D public or private visibility of the compute instance correct answer, C number of OCPU, amount of RAM, bandwidth question, which describes a key benefit of using Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, OCI. A OCI offers consistent performance with a predictable pricing model. B. With OSI, you can only run Java-based workloads on bare metal. C. Only bare metal workloads are supported on OCI. D. With OSI, you can run only cloud-native workloads. Correct answer. A. OCI offers consistent performance with a predictable pricing model. Question. Which should you use to distribute incoming traffic between a set of web servers? A. Load balancer. B. Dynamic Routing Gateway C. Internet Gateway D. Auto Scaling Correct answer. A. Load Balancer Question. Which Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Service can you use to assess user security of your Oracle databases? A. Audit Service B. Audit Vault and Database Firewall Option for Oracle Database Enterprise Edition C. Oracle Data Guard D. Oracle Data Safe Correct answer. D. Oracle Data Safe Question which offers the lowest pricing for storage, per GB. A. Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Archive Storage. B. Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Object Storage, Standard Tier. C. Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Block Volume. D. Oracle Cloud Infrastructure File Storage. Correct answer. C. Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Block Volume. Question. What does Oracle's Payment Card Industry Data Security Standard, PCI DSS, at a station of compliance provide to customers. A. Customers can use these services for workloads that provides validation of cardholder transaction, but only as third-party vendor. B. Customers can use these services for workloads to process applications for credit card approval securely. C. Customers can use these services for workloads that store, process, or transmit cardholder data. D. Customers can use these services for workloads that process, or transmit cardholder data but not store it? Correct answer. D. Customers can use these services for workloads that process or transmit cardholder data but not store it. Question. Which capability can be used to protect against unexpected hardware or power supply failures within an availability domain? A. Fault domains. B. Top of rack switches. C. Compartments. D. Power distribution units. Correct answer. A fault domains, question. Oracle Cloud Infrastructure is compliant with which three industry standards? Choose three. A Health Insurance Portability and Accountability Act, HIPAA. B Healthcare Compliance Association, HCCA. C NERC Critical Infrastructure Protection Standards. D SOC 1 Type 2 and SOC 2 Type 2 attestations. E-150-27-001-2013 Certification Correct answer A Health Insurance Portability and Accountability Act, HIPAA D. SOC 1 Type 2 and SOC 2 Type 2 Attestations E-150-27-001-2013 Certification Question which Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Service leverages Terraform to configure infrastructure as code? A. Compartment Explorer B. Resource Manager C. Oracle Functions D. Events Correct answer B. Resource Manager Question Which feature allows you to logically group and isolate your Oracle Cloud Infrastructure resources? A. Identity and Access Management Groups B. Tenancy C. Availability Domain D. Compartments Correct answer D. Compartments Question which three services integrate with Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, OSI, Key Management? Choose three. A. Identity and Access Management. B. Block Volume. C. Auto Scaling. D. Functions. E. File Storage. 
F. Object Storage, correct answer. A. Identity and Access Management. B. Block Volume. F. Object Storage, question. Which statement about Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, OSI, shared security model is true? A. You are responsible for managing security controls within the physical OCI network. B. You are responsible for securing all data that you place in OCI. C. You are responsible for securing the hypervisor within OCI Compute Service. D. You are not responsible for any aspect of security in OCI. E. File Storage F. Object Storage Correct answer C. You are responsible for securing the hypervisor within OCI Compute Service. Question. Which Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Identity and Access Management Capability helps you to organize multiple users into teams? A. Dynamic Groups B. Groups. C. Policies. D. Users. Correct answer. B. Groups. 